diabetes is not an easy disease and it, uh, it keeps you busy with blood sugar checks. You have to think about carbohydrate counting. You have to uh, check your um, patterns, blood sugar patterns. And um, the whole idea about the system is we're trying to give people a break and let the system do some of the work so they can they don't have to think about diabetes as much and uh, just they can enjoy their lives so uh, for people with diabetes um, I think this is going to be an amazing opportunity to uh, use utilize technology uh, to take away some of the burden uh, of diabetes management. And uh, another major advantage is, um, while it's uh, taking away some of the burden, it's also a safe system. And uh, at night, uh, there isn't, uh, the, the blood sugar control is outstanding. And none of the clinicians, I'm a clinician myself, uh, we're not that good. We cannot adjust insulin dose every night for each patient and optimize it in a way that uh, they will have uh, perfect blood sugars throughout the night. And um, you know, a lot of people worry about low blood sugars in the middle of the night, but if you have a system uh, adjusting insulin and um, checking patterns, glucose patterns, every five minutes, uh, that's, that's amazing. That's how you can achieve uh, almost perfect control overnight and you don't have to worry about it. You can sleep through the night. Uh, I'm a pediatric endocrinologist, so for my um, patient group, their parents can sleep at night. Um, our kiddos can go to sleepovers. They don't have to worry about, you know, what's gonna happen with blood sugars. Their parents can actually check the system, see what's going on. And uh, on top of that, um, now they have a little bit of freedom to uh, actually do whatever they want because system will alert them if the blood sugar, the predicted blood sugar is uh, kind of going to be low in a, in a, at a certain time point. So those are all benefits of it um, for people with diabetes. As a clinician, um, 70 to 80 percent of our patients uh, are not within target range. And um, despite everything we try, uh, we, uh, we cannot even reach um, a 50 percent uh, or a 30 percent improvement, but uh, with these systems, uh, there's a great opportunity. And if you have 70, 80 percent of your patients uh, in poor glycemic control, that translates into future complications. Uh, so while we're trying to um, discover the cure for diabetes, uh, we can't afford to wait for a cure. In the meantime, we have to keep uh, our patients happy, healthy, and uh, from a clinician perspective, I think uh, artificial pancreas hybrid close-up system um, can achieve uh, better glycemic control and uh, you know also reduce complications of future diabetes if we can keep uh, improving uh, blood sugar control uh, and uh, our patients will be healthy until we discover the cure for diabetes. So uh, those are we're hoping that those are going to be uh, like some outcomes of, of hybrid close-up once it's implemented uh, uh, widely in the clinical um, field.